Hello, friends. Imagine this. A warship sailing into enemy waters. Without a single person on board. No captain, no sailors, not even a lookout. It's silent, stealthy, and fully autonomous. Sounds like a scene from a science fiction movie, right? But this is now a military reality, thanks to Turkey. Turkey has just unveiled the I Destroyer, a next generation unmanned patrol boat developed by Diyasan Shipyard. This vessel may be small in size, but it's big in ambition, combining AI, robotics, and remote warfare to transform naval operations. The iDestroyer is what's called a USV, an unmanned surface vehicle. In simpler terms, it's a boat that doesn't need a human crew. Developed by Diyasan, this vessel is designed for patrolling coastlines, protecting naval assets, conducting surveillance, and even launching missile strikes. The iDestroyer is equipped with a 12.7mm remote-controlled weapon station, electro-optical and infrared sensors, and advanced radar systems. It's not just remote-controlled, it's smart. It uses AI algorithms to make decisions, detect threats, and can work in swarms with multiple vessels communicating in real time. The vessel can reach speeds of over 40 knots, stay operational at sea for up to four days, and be upgraded with missiles or mine-hunting equipment. Why is Turkey investing in this technology? Turkey is reducing foreign military dependency and is surrounded by strategic waters, the Aegean Sea, Black Sea, and Eastern Mediterranean. By deploying unmanned vessels like the iDestroyer, Turkey can project power more safely, avoid risking human lives, and respond faster to threats. This isn't just regional. Countries like the US, China, Israel, and Russia are racing to develop similar vessels. Turkey is among the first to deploy a combat-ready version. This could trigger an unmanned arms race where navies build robotic fleets that patrol seas and launch attacks without endangering human soldiers. The I Destroyer is more than just a patrol boat. It's a symbol of how fast warfare is evolving. Autonomous ships, AI-driven combat, the future is now. Turkey is making a bold move in redefining warfare, but this raises critical questions. Will these systems be used for defense or aggression? Who controls them in conflict? Let me know what you think in the comments. Will unmanned ships make the world safer or more dangerous?